In 1899, Nikola Tesla stood beneath the Colorado sky, chasing whispers in the dark. He wasn't trying to talk to people. He was trying to talk to the universe. His tower rose like a lightning rod to the heavens, copper veins glowing blue, thunder answering his call. Tesla believed the Earth was alive, not a rock floating in space, but a resonant body, humming with invisible energy that connected every star. One night, as his machine screamed with light, his receiver began to pulse. Beep, beep, beep. Not lightning, not static. A rhythm. Tesla stared at the pattern and whispered, someone or something is answering. The world called him mad. But decades later, scientists would find pulsars, stars sending rhythmic radio beats across galaxies. Maybe Tesla heard them first. Maybe the universe had spoken, and he was the only one listening. He once said, If you wish to understand the universe, think in terms of energy, frequency, and vibration. Everything, matter, mind, emotion is vibration. You're vibrating now. Your thoughts are waves. Your heartbeat sends ripples through the quantum field. Tesla wasn't searching for aliens. He was tuning into the frequency of existence itself. Maybe the signals he caught weren't from another world. Maybe they were from ours, echoing through time, waiting for someone who could hear them. When Tesla tried to speak to the stars, the stars might have whispered back, not in words, but in light. 